Jalen James was a star at Des Moines East High School finding success on the football field and in the classroom. He ranked first in his class with a perfect 4.0 GPA and also lettered in track and field in baseball. He was able to make a smooth transition to college as he's been in the Panthers starting lineup the past four years and he's considered one of the best wide receivers in FCS football. Brad Wells has the story. Over the past four years, wide receiver Jalen James has made his presence felt. As a freshman, he started six games and scored his first career touchdown against fourth-ranked North Dakota State. Now that he's heading into his senior season, this six-foot, four-inch target is planning one huge farewell tour as a UNI Panther. He might be one of the guys that put in the most work this summer, so I'm excited to see um, everything that the future holds for him because I've seen firsthand how much he cares about football, how much he cares about this team, um, cares about you and I, and how much work he's put in um, to have this moment. So uh, there's, there's few people that work the way he does, and so I'm excited, and I hope uh, nothing but the best for him. The work that Jalen put in since last season goes much farther than spring drills and team activities. Jalen was searching for every advantage that would help him on game days. First step I took was this spring I actually went down to Texas. I trained with uh, David Robinson. He trains um, guys like Antonio Brown, um, Des Bryant, a bunch of big name guys. And I worked out with him for about a week and uh, kind of just took in everything that he was teaching me. And basically what I've done was I took what he taught me that whole week and have just applied it to every single workout that I do. So whether it's lifting and running or if it's me working on my routes, um, I'm kind of just taking what he taught me and applying it. I think it's really helped me um, further my game as far as on the field. Um, obviously lifting is very important, but in order to be good at football, you gotta be good at football. So um, I think, you know, being able to learn from him and you know learn from the guys that are in the NFL already, I took that next step forward. One of the guys in the NFL Jalen has learned from is former UNI Panther, now Indianapolis Colt, Darice Fountain. James and Fountain were wide receivers together for three years at UNI. Jalen's summer experience exposed him to an even larger roster of NFL talent. He's hoping to soon join the league and his former teammate in catching passes on Sundays. When I was down there, um, I seen Des Bryant, Taylor Gabriel, um, Corey Coleman, um, Actually, probably the best part about it was I ran routes for Patrick Mahomes. Um, that was probably the highlight of the whole time. It was pretty awesome. Um, but it, I mean, it just goes to show that um, what I, the biggest thing I took from that was that I'm so close yet so far away. Um, when I was down there, I kind of realized, you know, I'm just one of these guys. I'm literally one of these guys. Um, the only thing that I have to do is just continue to get better and better every single day and um, hopefully, you know, be in their shoes at one point. Before the season opened, Jalen was named one of four captains for this year's UNI football team. It's a testament to the leadership that he's demonstrated over the last two seasons, but also to the preparation he puts in to getting better every practice, every film session, and every year. He represents a lot of what UNI is about. When you come in, you work hard, you keep your head down, and you just get better. And just from seeing him four years ago to where he is now, he's a completely different football player. He's a big physical presence out there. Uh, he's running as well as he's ever ran. He's catching the football as well as he's ever ran. And you can tell that he has a lot of confidence in his ability. And we're really, really just excited to see Jalen go out there and, in my opinion, play his best football that he's played for the program in the world. Jalen and the rest of the Panthers are home this Saturday, September 21st, against Idaho State at 4 p.m. inside the Unidome. It'll be a special Hall of Fame weekend on the UNI campus. Still to come on this edition of Panther Sports Talk, we hit the golf course with the men's golf program, feature an all-conference performer for the volleyball team, and more with Bobby Peterson. This is Panther Sports Talk.